Oh, believe me, a positive comment can save your channel. Save from what? From the creator. Because the creator can be the threat of his channel. So let me tell you a story that happens so often with me and my channel. Once again, I was thinking, is it worth taking all the effort, talking on things with the imagination, I want to help people, give some insights, share my knowledge, do I reach people, will people understand me, do they really get the message that I want transport to them? We as creators, online creators, we are very emotional because we make everything on our own. We have an idea, we make the recording, we make the editing, we make everything, we make the thumbnail. Creating video content is quite a bit of work and not just one, another one and another one and another one. And when we put the video out, we are full of expectations because we made it all alone. Am I completely wrong? Or was this a genius message that the audience is waiting for? We don't know. And we have a lot of expectations. When we have a lot of views, then we might think, yes, it seems appealing to others. And this already motivates to continue. But when we have very few views, no feedback at all, we start doubting. Is this really worth it? Are my ideas so stupid that nobody wants to listen? I myself thought, this is a genius idea. I want to share it. Probably this helps other people to get to a new level. But if I was completely wrong and people don't like the video, they won't even write a negative comment because they didn't like it. They just switch off and go to another video. In this case, everything is open. They won't tell you what you made wrong in the video and you stay in doubt. These days, I once again thought, is it really worth putting so much effort? Creating content takes a lot of time. And when we don't see an adequate feedback, we should reflect, is this worth doing it? Is this worth doing it at all? Or at least should we change the topic? But we don't change the topic only to get viewers. We have an inner message I have. And then today I got a wonderful comment. Just three, four sentences. If you want to hear them, why not? It's public. Lucille wrote, as always, dear sir, you get to the heart and soul with your words of wisdom. I thank you so much and God bless you. And when I wrote this, I thought, okay, someone received the message that I put in my videos. So this means my ideas were transferred at least to one person. Probably more, a lot of people don't write a comment. And when we get a feedback like this, this means, okay, it still makes sense to continue. Probably there might be more in the future. So do you see, as creators, we are full of expectations and emotions and a negative comment can destroy you, can destroy your channel. Because when you don't want to continue your channel, the creator destroys the channel. So when I said a positive comment can save the channel, your channel, from whom? From the creator himself. I build up this channel and I can kill the channel at any time. I can kill the topic at any time. For sure, we put in persistence, endurance and everything. But we are always reflecting. What comes back? Is it still worth it? Because when we are on a completely wrong path, 
it's time to kill the channel, to kill the activity. But when we once get a comment like this, this makes us continue. So praise your good comments and let them motivate you to continue. There are already very few of them, but they are so important. This is the only feedback that keeps you with a smile on track. Therefore, I thank Lucille for another comment that keeps me in the hope to reach more people. It keeps me continuing with my project here and finding people that think this channel was helpful. And I think it's worth to follow this channel in the future. So thank you for all the feedback, especially the positive feedback. This keeps me doing what I'm doing. And we can meet us in one of my other videos.